sentenced to the charge of first degree murder. Verdict as to count one. We, the jury, find the defendant not guilty. Today's lesson, you can't judge a case until it's over. I believe everybody in the world had Casey Anthony convicted of the crime that she was being tried for. And there was all kinds of analysis all along the way about how the judge's rulings went, how arguments went, how certain testimony went. And a lot of people took it all to mean that Casey Anthony was going to be convicted. When I'm in trial, I find that oftentimes our emotions run high when we're putting on our part of the case. And then our emotions have a tendency to dip when the other side's putting on their part of the case. And sometimes my clients will say to me, well, it seems like the judge is ruling against us all the time. Does that mean we're losing? And I always say, never judge your case until it's completed and don't judge it based on what you think is going on in the courtroom. Judge it only by this. Did I assess the case properly? Did I create an appropriate plan? And did I execute my plan properly? That's the way you judge a case, and you can never be sure of how it's going to turn out until it's over, and the Casey Anthony case proves that.